fashion, do it Gucci fashion. Uh, Gotta bring the cash and talk it, I ain't bragging. Uh, 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 she say she love the kids, fell in love with dick. dick, dick. I fell in love with man, I get on that and yell out some shit. Yo, but Griselda, shout out to Griselda. Nah, I mean, they got these bass down here. I heard the um, I heard a couple songs Griselda did. I fucked with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah.
known that in Bob's. Hey, shit, Ray Dex podcast does not support all the views of this guy right here with the drug abuse. No, shit, Ray <laughs> We really not a drug, though. We not a drug. <laughs> Nah, I get behind that. What's your what's your vice? What's my vice? Ooh. Yeah, everybody who knows me know I jerk. Now nah, can, 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 can I have you change your question? Because it's gonna be a more profound question. I want everybody to answer the question. What is your preference? Nah, what keeps you alive? What keeps me alive? Yeah. Like what keeps you alive? Like what keeps you thriving in this motherfucker? My family. What else? Now, give me three things. Give me the top three things that keep y'all out. My kids, chasing success. And, uh, honestly, my, my inner self. Yeah, I have self talking to you. Right? Yeah. Talk to my yeah. friend. Right? I say you? my kids. I say my kids. My people. And my name, man. I think for me, Music, my family, kids first at the top of that list, but my family, everybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah my yeah, family. Yeah. And, um, like, weed, man. I, <laughs> like, weed, man. I mean, like, right. like, she <laughs> like, right. I think, I think without music and weed, <laughs> like, hey, I think without music and weed, I think music and weed kept me alive, kept me away from a lot of felonies. Which part that you made? Like, I think there was certain times, like even with shit that they perceived, like you would think, like, yo, nigga, go listen to DMX, get amped up, and go do something to somebody. Oh, yeah. There's songs that yeah. I can listen to on Dark and Hell is Hot that made me go sit my ass down when I was about to go low out on the hill, like dead ass. You know what I mean? And just sat there and just thought about it. And even Lupe with that hip hop saved my life right now. Yeah. You know what I mean? He was talking about his dude. Remember, I redid it in the car and all that shit. I think I redid that beat harder than Lupe. Man, he crazy as hell. Don't ever say that about the damn Lupe, man. What the hell? Oh, let me zoom really in. On, let me zoom in on it, man. Look, I, 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 I probably was the only no. one that had all his albums no, when he no, dropped. No, me too. Okay. Yeah, I'm just a few new fans. Don't do not ever. Look, how many of my cue though? Verse 15. Nah. This man said harder than Lupe. Wait, how many of my cue though? Now, this camera? Yeah. You talking about me? Man, get out of here. Period. Get out of here. Hey, man, go ahead and keep pushing with that shit. Period. Really? That's what you're supposed to tell him, go ahead and yeah. push with that shit, man. Some that whole... You know, uh, trying to know, I mean, I'm on next, back to what you were saying, I'm going to cut y'all brothers off. No, no, go ahead. Um, I'll hold it a little bit. Yeah, I like Show to hold it a little bit. Pack it up. On the third bank. <laughs> Pack it up. <laughs> yeah. Hold on, hold on. I am going to say something. I am going to say something. It's always home team first, so yes. I think it's better to move that. But listen, but listen. I will say this, though. Line for line. Bar for bar, I'm on par with any of you niggas. Okay, I get now, that. that. And I guarantee it, if you break down my line with your line, line for line, I don't care if it's a Cole, I don't care if it's a Kendrick, I don't care. I guarantee it, artistically. So uh, you don't smoke Kendrick. Oh, I was I sleep surprised by it. I, I, I was surprised by your sound though. I said I bar know. for bar. Dude, no accent though. Bar for bar. I say I smoke. Uh, uh, How I mix words together. I say I smoke. I'm on par with anything. But you ain't. Words. Y'all kind of in two different worlds though. So I, I would want to hear what, what you were talking about on the why, track. This why I'm better than Lupe. I can jump in word. I can jump in. Hold on. Not sit, boy. Listen. I'm not sit on word. I'm gonna tell you what that name was. I can, I can do all this. I'm gonna tell you he why. He can probably do that too, though. I'm gonna tell you why I'm not. Home from West Chicago. I'm gonna, I'm gonna so, tell you. I'm gonna tell you why. He can like, jump in. Jeff, 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 I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you why. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you why I said Luke way on high. In this one bar, this nigga said it smells like hot. It smells like hot dog water and tear drips. It feels like hot dog water and tear drips. That bro, how the fuck, did... nigga? You from the projects? How is that bar that hard? It felt like hot dog water and tear drips. Like, nigga, I'm crying. And it's cold hot dog water. Look at this goddamn thing. They're not feeling this boy. Nigga, that was church. Tell me that's not church. Lupe man. went hard, man. That's church. Look. On the cool, the like cool this. was the hardest shit where the nigga died and he was talking about how he got killed and all that shit. Came back, talking about how the nigga would have killed him. Lupe harder than Kendrick? Hell yeah. 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 So y'all see Hell yeah. Oh, yeah. This they smoked the, the only one that smoked the whole TV. This the beauty of him. 
camera. Let me say, we the only one that smoked the whole thing. This nigga got down, can't now. One of them nigga brought in, got down. Exactly. But see, uh, all right. Uh, I, I, know I, know what you, I know what you're saying, right? I know what this you're saying. This nigga feel like them niggas can't fuck with me. I, 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 I get what you're saying. Yeah, but, but, see, but see, now, but this is the thing. Yeah. We're having a conversation from a different section of life. That's see, it's like, like, like a commentator. It's like how those ex football players be talking about football on ESPN. Play downs about shit. So yeah. the fan that's trying to tell me that Young Thug is better than Lupe, you a fucking fan, nigga. But you can't put words together. Up. But hold on, I mean, if you're an artist, if you're an artist or an A and R, then I look at your opinion a little bit different because then you can explain to me artistically. Okay, let's say, but well, see, but but, but, but you, you speaking from that point of view. Exactly, that's, that's what I'm saying. Because you feel like they're in a way, but people feel like you, right? Yeah. No, I'm just saying for me, I'm not, I'm not. I'm not respecting the motherfucker's opinion that has nothing to do with the culture. The nigga on Instagram. If you're right. just a fan, if yeah. you're just a fan, I I respect your shit. Just a fan. Yeah. Says, I respect your opinion as in you can have a fan. Just a fan. I study this shit. Yeah, that's but what you, I do. Yeah, I study. You, I study it, like Literally. But it's like a thesis, dog. If you ain't got supporting facts in your thesis, your thesis, mm. your shit's dead. Your opening statement's dead. And look, so it's like you ain't got no. What, what's your I, can say, I, I know for a fact, I'm 100% more than a fact. Oh yeah, that's what I'm saying, you're talking from a I've been doing side. this shit, 06, 2019. I never quit, I, I never tried nothing else. I never uh, do, do some other shit. I retired. I never, I never did none of that. So shit that niggas who retired or stopped licking probably missed, I saw. Mm -hmm. I saw everything. Mm -hmm. Shit before I was love, I went back and researched shit from the 80s mm -hmm. all the way up. Until shit come about ten years from now. You I, ain't, I ain't take no days off. Shit. So when you took days off, to me, you automatically behind me. You took ten years off. You know how much shit you miss? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You know what I'm saying? Now let me. You know how much shit you miss? Hold on, but let me show you something. 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 I study every day. I mean, this, this not a hot. This not my side. Because it's two different. Because it's two different. I know how to get money and do this. Hold on, there's two different things though. Because you can be active, right? And that means that you're actively making music and actively put music out. Right? No, no, active a part of the culture. Yeah. Oh, now there you go. Because sometimes I'm shooting sure moves. There you go. I'm not so you can actively be a part of the culture. When I say I retired, like I retired from. Participating in putting music out. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Facts. But I was still participating. But I was still participating within the industry as far as like artist development and putting other artists out or putting records together. You know what I mean? Shit yeah. like that. You should. Absolutely. You miss a lot of shit. No. I was man. always I was always man. around this shit, bro. Man. Always. Man. The difference was the difference was I took myself from being a quarterback to being an offensive coordinator. Know what I mean? I, I, I took myself from being the person that leads the ball to the person that tells you where to throw the ball instead of the person that's throwing the ball. I look at it like this, bro. Directions. Look at it like this. Every man got his own shit. Yeah. So when it comes to this hip hop shit, like, to me, from my point of view, like, you got niggas who in it and ain't, I ain't stunning it because the way it's going, it ain't as authentic as it's the rest. Two Bad. things though. Hold on, hold on. Yeah. You did what I'm saying? Right. So it can appear like a nigga ain't doing shit, but you're maneuvering through this shit for some kind of way, motherfucker still know you. Exactly. From, exactly. You know what I'm saying? Like when it's all said and done, who rides? Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. No matter if a nigga in it every day, or a nigga sitting back. Like, all right, boom, here go my time, right here, boom, I'm in your face. So, what man, what, what, what man, what man won't when it comes to the topic of how a nigga doing it? Because a nigga drop it consistently well, versus a nigga. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Well, when I say, you know? when I say, I'm talking, well, well, right now I'm speaking on two different things. Yeah. Because y'all saying doing it, I'm saying knowing it. Mm. I cannot rap for eight years and come back and talk. Oh, That's the word I'm yeah. saying. All right, I ain't talking about that part. I'm talking about knowing the day in and day out what's going on in the office. Absolutely. If you're not in the office, I'm going to fuck what you say. Absolutely. If you're not in the office, you're not going to know what's going on. But this is the thing. What, what I'm if, if you're not in the football room, you're Absolutely. not going to know what a weak side band it is. But what I'm saying, saying is this. Here. But what all I was saying was. When business shit, you start doing Spygate. If you're not playing football, you're not going to know about it. But what I'm saying is you get tricked every time. You can change your position in the room. Know what I mean? But if you're not in the room. Yes, well, if you're not in the room. You take time off. You're not in the room. 
Let's say you took time off and you still was in the room. Yeah, if you took time off from a certain section of the game. Like, if I. I'm talking about period. I ain't talking about oh, just. Oh, yeah, yeah, I got you. All this shit, bro, to me, we all got different point of view, bro. Long, I feel like. That would make it dope, though. I feel like long as men that's doing this shit getting money out of this shit, I feel like. Look oh, good. Okay, that, this I, I'm like, hold up, bro, I'm just saying, like. Yeah. I feel like you doing this shit look good at it and be be, be content with your, your way. Cause we got everybody in this bitch, different people. A lot of people all attacking this shit a whole oh, nother way. A lot of people did it. You see what I'm saying? Do you, do you, do you think there should be a clear separation between hip hop and rap? I think our biggest problem is not treating rap the way it should be treated. How should it be treated? In your it should be treated like it's been created the way it's a big ass poem. It's a big ass, like a big ass lake, bro. This hip hop shit, like a big ass lake. You got your rod, I got mine, you got yours. We got our beta, our hooks. Like, we letting one person dictate certain shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, you gotta be with these folks to get some money. We gotta, we gotta get out of that and, and feel like we all can do that shit. I right, so big ass get to, do you know what I'm saying? Do you think there's a difference between a rapper and an MC? Yeah, you know, I'm trying to get you a fine line or something. I definitely do. I think it's different between the, you know how I do it, a rapper and an artist. That's mm -hmm. how I do it. A rapper is a far for far nigga. An artist can paint pictures and make movies. Mm -hmm. A far for far nigga. Then why? That's why I'm trying to frighten me. Then why I think of the. Cause I can go be both if I wanted to. I can rap like Clemson sings. I did five million rap like cut and sink. You see what I'm saying? I, I can do that. That's whole. Like, yeah, like, I know. You see what I'm saying? Like, we can do that easily. That shit easy. Like, oh, no? That's like no more. Come on, man. <laughs> like, Come on, man. man. No, 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 he no, he, no, he no. said he said no. like he don't know what in the room or hole. Yeah, it's probably a hole. He was probably the last one in the hole. Yeah, we been a hole. You the last one in the hole. In the room, bro. That's a lie. I've been a hole. I've been a hole since before. Of course, I'm a fifth. I'm all about a dollar. What the fuck is 50 cent? We, we, we love that. We, we love that. Okay. I love Jigga Cop. Big business, man. Oh, crazy. Bro. That shit crazy when it, when it coming from three different breweries, bro. Yeah, it is. How you feel? Like, I look at this shit and be thinking about the money. Like, yeah. I don't even be thinking about who balls it. I can get on that too. All right. All right. If I'm put in that environment, you put me in that environment, ain't nothing gonna happen to me. Exactly. Oh, nigga, no, I'm done. So exactly. we ready to rap and we playing basketball, football. Exactly. So you think about the weed, the so, whatever. So we so feel I'm gonna be in the right? room. Exactly. But I ain't gotta. I don't help. I'm gonna make you see it. Yeah. But it, it's past rap though. That's how I feel about rap. Like, okay. Let's come here. We can we can go in the room and and do the bars and shit, but. I'm looking at Jay Z and them niggas on the grown man shit. So how oh, deep yeah. is they into the lyrics? If you, nigga, Jay Z, I know the corner freestyle. So check, so check. I, Even though he hard to hit, I'm glad you brought that point up. I'm glad you brought that point up. That's so, what I'm saying. So for the kids out there, right? So for the youngsters out there that's trying to rap, right? If it's about the bag, who got a bigger bag, Future or Jay Z? I ain't even close. Now who you wanna be? Man, now do you wanna be the lyrical nigga? That made a billion dollars, or you want to be the nigga talking about lean that don't even participate in that type of culture that drinks asparagus juice for real and takes care of his fucking body, right. but got kids out here leaned out, churned the fuck out. Now I mean, he ain't even telling them the facts about how he takes care of them. Jay Z, Jay Z, we come from the street. They but but, but, see, but see, Jay Z been, been in the game see, thirty years. But see, but Jay, but when Jay talking this about been in it, in the thirty, 30 years. years. But even when Jay came in talking about hustling, mm -hmm. it was from the aspect always from a business mind. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It was right. always from a business mind. Yeah, it was always from nigga. He even said it in the line. If I want to get, I got a hundred mil. If I want to get any further, I got to take a different route. Know what I mean? Yeah. So it's like he was already putting that shit in his music the whole time, the whole thirty years. Let me ask, let me ask y'all this: Is Jay a real nigga and a fuck nigga? You can't oh, I, I don't say you can't beat it. I don't say you can't beat it. You can't beat it. You can't beat it. You can't beat it. Explain 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 it.
right? You, know, ah, you can't do it. Fuck about when you want to play the club. Like you said, it shit ain't for me either. Yeah. So I'm gonna say what I wanna say. Yeah. Right? You need some more. Gotta speak your mind. Damn, yeah, bro, that's what the show about, bro. We gotta keep our eyes. Yeah, they be bullshit too much. Too. Nah, but listen, nah, I feel like you fuck me in the real. You can't be real. Because, be bro. Damn, do some real shit. Damn, do some real shit. Because it's why. Fuck, nigga. Damn, like, damn. damn. Why you talking about it? I'm not talking about how we talking in the hood. No offense to Jay. Nah, I mean, I fuck with Jay. But then how we talking on Bankhead? Then how we talk about Bankhead? We say fuck, nigga, when we say, instead of saying wrong, Type of guy. <laughs> that, 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 that's how we talk. We say fuck nigga. Nigga, I'm trying to hear the argument. I don't even want to say the argument. What the argument? Good. What the argument? Good, we say fuck nigga. All right, chill. All right, guys. Okay. Guys. All right. Cause Jay do some real ass shit. What did he do? Shit over here, you be like, Jay did that. What did he do? Say. What did Jay do? Say. Jay did niggas in jail. Who did he do? Who did he do? Hold on, who did he leave? Hold on, who did he leave? Like, it, it, it was a story that came out. He left one of his ben early partners. Before that, before that, Big. He brought out Big's and Jay for the property. No, 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 no. He is brought that shit. Hold on, watch that shit. Hold on, 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 if you teach a nigga how to fish, he talking about fish. Hold on, you teach a nigga how to fish, and that nigga goes to his own pond and he catch ten trout, and he pull up on you with a sack full of trout. You can't look at that man and be like, Oh, that ain't what happened. How is that not what happened? That ain't what hold happened. Hold on, hold on, hold on. They ain't sat there and ate these niggas. They ain't sat there and ate them niggas alive at Def Jam. Yo, y'all niggas that caught up. Up. Hold on, he sat there and told nah, me. Nah, nah, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. 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 Hold on, Let's recoup our money. Wow. Now I mean, now you. You don't got this. Hold on. Damn. Hold on. Now, Dane, you don't got the same that idea. Happened. Hold on. Dane, you don't got the same idea I got. It is what happened. Because we are COVID. Okay. Hold on. We are COVID was on the Breakfast Club and said straight up. He had a rapper? Yeah. You believe what crackers say? Hell no. Nigga, because of Dane. Hell no. It's not about what you know. Hold on. Hold on. You had it wrong. Let's go. No, this is the problem. It's not about believing what the cracker said. It's about, no, it's about believing what the nigga said. Now, how's the nigga say? Now, 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 watch. Now, watch. How's the nigga say? No, no, watch. That didn't let the white boy come between us. Hold on, hold on, hold on. The white boy. Hold on, now, watch. The white boy, boy squeeze in. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. He got a point. He got a point. No, I'm about to show you. If me and you doing, if all three of them been there, right? Hell, the white boy get in the middle. I'm about to show you. I'm about to show you. And he and what we going to? Now, let me show you. Let me show him. I'm the guy. So you got Leon Cohen, right? He the white boy. He the big Jew. Come here. Hold on. He the big Jew in the room, right? This nigga know the billionaire. Mm -hmm. He whispering to Jay Z the whole time, like, yeah, y'all want to know y'all hundred million dollar brand? Okay, let me stop it right there. I gotta stop it. To a billion? I gotta stop it right there. I gotta stop it right there. Why do you think Jay Z? Why do you think Jay Z the song I had to take a different route? Hold on. Brother, I gotta stop it right there. Let me say something. Let me say something. What the demon, the devil will always go to the weakest one who they know will listen. Yep. He know Damon B is gonna be like, bro, yeah. we probably couldn't make more with you, but then my pop. Yeah. And we in. They, all, oh, they yeah. holding it down. Jay, they holding it down. <laughs> Jay don't got down. I love them niggas, them niggas. Man, he means, but fuck him. Just cause it's business. I ain't that type of nigga, bro. Like, y'all help me. When I get that level, I ain't gonna sell y'all out because they make me more money. Yeah, and then the thing is, let it be between us. But I get that. It can't be a white boy. Hold on. But let me take Hold on. Let me pose this question to you. I can't sell y'all out. Let me pose this question to y'all. Nigga calling my phone now. Y'all help me in the Let me pose this question. That's what Jay do. That's what Jay do. Let me pose this question. Say it was the same situation, right? Say it was the same situation, right? Say you're big, say you're Dave, right? Say I'm Jay. Say they come to me, I take the deal with New York, right? I take off for three, four, five years, right? Mm -hmm. Y'all niggas making y'all videos, y'all man, this, that, I get a billion dollars. I pop back up, I'm running Rock Nation. I come back and bread y'all niggas. 
Is you still tight? How the fuck? Hold on, hold on. No, 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 no. You talking 20 years later? No, 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 no. Hold on, I'm not talking 20 years later, though. I'm talking about if he would have did it. Like, no, I'm talking about if he would have did it from the jump. If he would have did it when it was like, when shit happened. I'm saying if it's Just leave me speak to niggas no more. No. You can speak to a nigga on the low. Like, say if we get to the point where we can't do something again. Because you said something. Because you said something. I can't speak. No, no, the shit is out. I hear what you're trying to say. Listen, though. When we get to the point of being in where you say some shit, I might have a deal with Sprite, and I can't be seen talking to you. Yeah. I'm still not gonna not top you. I'm gonna top you on low. Okay. I, I, I look at it. I get that. I'm not gonna like fuck she forever. I get that. I get that. But what I'm saying is, uh, uh, let a nigga come between me. All right. I, I, <laughs> you know what I'm saying. I, I get. We still gonna make a hundred million. I get what you're saying, my nigga. But these are two visionary niggas, and we on the phone six hours a day talking about how we gonna get to a building, right? Right? Mm -hmm. And they not letting us get to this building. We see the shit clear. They blocking us off at every section. But we, we can't win it though. Hold on. We winning, but we not winning how we vision this shit. We're not going to the place that we were trying to go because they're capping us off. They building the ceiling around us as we speak, man. Yeah. And we're seeing this shit happen. The man yeah. comes to me in the corner and says, you know what? I can get you exactly where y'all want to be. But you gotta take a different route. Mm. Yeah. You gotta take a different route. You gotta leave them hood niggas alone. Mm. They can't come to the office with you. And then you gotta let me answer that. No, not that definitely. Am I a nut? Are you a nut? Are you a nut for turning that billion down for the honor of your nigga if you know you that your friend is to come get your nigga? Well, first. This, this is what I'm saying. In that scenario, mm -hmm. if I was in a billion, my niggas gonna know we close enough to know she ain't gonna get it. But they got the confidence to know I ain't no nigga finna come between it. Okay. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So you don't like, think like, that's what like, happened? Well, well, that I am. And I'm initially, if, if I'm Jay Z and I come in with two niggas that don't rap, right? Feel me? But one of the niggas is on this, but we super independent. Ain't no way you come between this shit right here. Then we, I supposed to be on that. Like fuck me, he shouldn't be able to penetrate. Now one of them is say, but you know all you got to do is. Cause what if all the niggas, what if it was three billion now, Jay-Z, Dame, and Kareem now? Oh yeah, that's a whole different see, ball game. You see what I'm saying? Like, they game. don't squeeze a whole nigga that ain't go through none of the trap with him, none of the printed tips. Do what I want to say. Do what I want to say. Spit it up. And shit is out, she. Shit is out, right? <clears throat> he got there 20 years later. By now, they would have been there. I don't think he had to think. Think about how powerful they is. He, he got big Dame and Jay. Nigga, Dame like fuck these four, but get him out the way. They were making hundreds of millions <laughs> twenty years ago. But this is you don't think they would have been there no, by now? No. And Dame no. like man, no, fuck I these know, niggas. But Jay. you know why? Not because they wasn't on course to make it. Bro, niggas got but listen eight hundred million on the low. Not, not because, you know that, right? Yeah, but not because they wasn't on course to make you know it. You know that, right? Yeah, but listen, not because they wasn't on course to make it on books, but because some people was going to do everything they could to prevent. This shit. They did it to everybody. But then when they did it, oh, they don't mean quick. They had the people. They don't mean quick. The white black guy. See what happened in countries. The boy. Yeah. Yeah. It's how the folks fight in countries. You, 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 you really hypocrite yourself. Why you be on other shows? I'm not. I'm not the hypocrite myself. But I'm telling you, we're in the wrong country. See, we let them fuck in. See, no. So basically, you tell me to say y'all lot. No. No. The problem is what you. The problem is you're listening. That's what he's doing. No. No. Basically, what you're doing is listening to your own point of view. Listen what you. Say, I'm telling you, he said it's okay. No, I didn't. So when I get to that level, my phone's oh, not right. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You're doing weird shit. Okay, never came out of my mouth. You're remixing. Mm -hmm. When I said, no. I can't okay. remember. Okay, never came out of my mouth. What I said was, <laughs> what I said was, I, I put up was. the whole position of, wonder if this nigga, wonder if that was his plan. And then this nigga went up. What I'm saying is, one day Jay, what I'm it. saying is, one day if Jay Z was the fuck nigga at the end, what if the whole plan was for him to go off course and do that because they knew they wasn't gonna let the thugs in the building, and when he and went off, he didn't. He just didn't come back and get what the nigga. Let me say it. Let me say it before you start. Let me say it. Okay. 
I, I feel like, oh, they building, we the building. Yeah. Nah, I hear what you're saying. They, they, us, they like, make us buy their shoes. But you make remember, us buy their shoes. But you remember what you said, she, when you was like, um, okay, go for it. Right? Yeah, no, right. but you remember what you said when you was like, yo, no, it'd be one thing. Man. It'd be one thing if I went over. If you, you was like, my people would have enough faith in me mm -hmm. if they said she. They, they saying if you told them like yo, you can't come, yeah. but they want to give me the building. Mm -hmm. The building. You said your people have enough faith in you for you to go yeah, and you know, come back. So what I was asking you, but the question was was I gotta say something. Do you think that that was the mute they might? Do you do you think that that was the position that hurt? Well, you gotta hear me out. No, let me say something, please. Let me say something. Let me say something. I want you to hear me out. You gotta say you gotta say for they build. Exactly. Look, we gotta get we gotta get to the front of the going off you We gotta get to the you was like I was responding to what you said. That was a question you asked me. I didn't initiate it. Yeah. Yeah. I would answer your question. Yeah, my people look my folk. Cause they know Exactly. You feel me? And then like I can't do it. I can't do it if I gotta cut cut them out. But when I'm tired in. But that's what exactly. I'm saying. But what I was trying to ask you was this. Do you think that that's what was going on and that, that nigga the fuck nigga move was him not coming back? Do you think the conversation? Yeah, is, look, that's what I'm asking. No, no, no. I don't think the conversation happened. I don't know. They, I don't know that they been. No, no, no. You know what? No, wait, no, wait, no, wait, no, wait, no, wait, no, wait, no, wait. I ain't gonna say that. The conversation did probably happen. That's what I'm and asking. Damon Big probably just was like, nah, and he still did. So they probably feel like, damn, you fucked me over. See, there was no okay to that. That's what I was asking. Okay, okay, okay so yeah. cool. So, but at the end of the day, though, look, for instance, right? This how I would do. Let's say when it came to this. Uh huh. They come to me, hey, Sam, I'm about to be a fat podcast, did this, that, right? Let me make some money over here. Ain't no way y'all ain't gonna be able to live off of the field. There's no way. Because niggas, I don't care if I don't make a billion, I make 300 million. Cool. What I can't buy with that? I don't know. What I can't do with less? Unless you up, you up. I'm telling you. Period. Yep. Now we go make the rest of the money by ourselves. Now with Dame, I'm finished. Now with Dame Mo, let's get a little bit, and we gonna make the rest of the money with the money we got. All these niggas, we up now. Now we go get this. We go get that, and we gotta keep going to him saying, "Let's <laughs> make a bigger deal." No, they ain't know that at the time. They block though. niggas though. This shit can be sold off to some other shit, but they block. We ain't off it forever. Look how Dame got a whole Netflix situation. He got his own Netflix. Damn that exactly. studio. But look how they blocking him. But he got all that content on there, but his shit ain't near as big as nothing else. Cool. They blocking him. So, so he coming what? in with niggas that's being blocked. But guess what though? But guess what though? But guess what though? He's still getting rich. They ain't missing one meal. And then like, you know, you're not saying that. You gotta know how to do it too, see, bro. But see, got a different vision. They trying to get a billion. Listen, man, when they started, it went just run straight to them. Yeah. It, it was a process. Man, that right. shit they ain't got going on now might be like that right now. Mm-hmm. No. That shit might be in this goddamn See, beginning of Rockefeller days. See, but what exactly. I'm saying, but what I'm saying with they that, is, no, that. But what I'm saying is with that. But what I'm saying is with that. They trying to block that nigga. See, they were scared of Dane. They was never scared of Dane. He said okay. some real shit. They talked to the weakest nigga. That was. He said some real shit. They talked to the weakest nigga. They were scared of Dane. Dane was the nigga that was in there telling them niggas like, you don't own us. Yeah. You work for us. Okay. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? So I can't you ride with, with that forever. Cause that nigga's a nut. I'm not disputing the fact that Jay's a nut. I'm a nut. That's some nutty shit. Cause if my man's okay. a nut, hold okay. on. So no. sometimes it's good to be a nut. No, it is. But what I'm saying is, sometimes look, being a nut save your life. I, I give you a perfect example. I Don't give you a, my style, I give you a perfect example. No. I give you a perfect example to this day. That man right there behind the camera, y'all can't see him. Gosh, know what I mean? What up, guy? I met this nigga. I met this nigga probably when I was 19, 18. I had this idea of Russell Singh music. You know what I mean? I was working with Dipset, writing shit for them niggas. He knew that shit. Yeah. Right? Met this nigga at the studio at Too High. He told me some real shit. We from the same region. I ain't know him when I was in Philly, but we from the same region, right? He told me some real shit. He was like, yo, my nigga, I rock with you. He was like, just fuck with me when you get right. I was like, nigga, I got you. As soon as I get the budget, I'm coming to fuck with you and your guys' beats or whatever. My shit fell through. I still, st I still stayed down, though. It wasn't like my shit fell through and I came with some story like blase blase. The point of that whole story is that you did the opposite of Jay. Exactly. You know what I mean? So it's yeah, like nigga beat nah, not real shit. <laughs> so it's like I'm not saying that Jay's not a nut for what he did. Only thing.
thing I was trying you to get out, to. Only thing I was trying to get to was what, what she was talking about, like how his people would trust him to go get the billion because they couldn't come and come back with the fucking bag. Yeah. I was wondering, maybe that was the same fucking plot that they had. Yeah. So what if you leave? Nah, they were already falling up. Huh? What if you leave whoever it is out in the street? What you call it? If I leave you out in the street, it depends yeah. on where, it depends on where you did. What you did for me and how long they had. Everybody gonna feel like I mean, it's, let, let's say. You walking through the door at Ben and Man. I'm talking about no before business. Damn, bro, we gotta come to agreement. Before yeah. business. Let's say, let's say, let's say sis started some shit, right? Mm -hmm. the, so another nigga, they catch on to whatever he doing. The look, the whatever. And that nigga get pulled okay, in. Okay, I got a response for that. Cause that happened to me three times with my art. I feel like just, just fuck with me. What you mean by that though? Like, it should be that I shouldn't be in the car before. But you what I'm saying, what if that person if leaving? Off, if you blew off what I created, anybody who blew off anything Tyler Perry created, if he called you, that's the phone and fuck with him. Yeah. He asked for. That's why Snoop go to everything P asked for. Yeah, that's that's, that's why. Because he said everything that. Eminem asked for. P said that's why when certain niggas, who, who real niggas, they pull up. Can we agree that's on the difference? difference. That ain't cause you ain't not coming. The master he say Snoop Dogg. He's not coming. <laughs> Fitty go run at the end of the No matter how big he talk, he still say he big dog. Yeah. He talk shit to everybody else. But he big dog. Cause he they put him in, put him in the game. So if you if you, grow, if you do anything off off his tree, you don't owe me that, but fuck with me when I call you. Let me ask you something about Fitty. Cause I, 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 That's I, how you owe me. Cause I, I like. I call you. I like that. Then you can't do it. I like. I like some of Fifty's business principles. But let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Cause I can tell it's like a far away mentor type shit, right? Will Smith. Yeah. Cool. So let me ask you this. Fifty had said some shit, right, about his label. Like he was like. <laughs> he was like, when a nigga get bigger than me, he gotta go. <laughs> like pull the footage up. Pull the footage up. I can't speak on that. Ain't All right, I got it. <laughs> <laughs> I got it. 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 I mean, uh, no, no, you're talking about game. Well, when hit that, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. And I put it into the content because I mean, <laughs> any nigga I fuck with, I know what he's saying because I talk that way. Yeah. I might say some shit you might not get, but niggas who ain't tone with it. Whoa, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Alright, so you're saying that, um, because I, I feel the same way about Kanye. I feel like. Now, what you saying? No, 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 because I'm about to connect with you. I'm about to connect with you before I ask you, I'm baby you real quick. Okay. So I feel the same way about Kanye, right? Yeah. About how people think he's crazy. Yeah. You know what I mean? But I see the genius behind what he's doing. Yeah. You know what I mean? So you're basically saying that, like, 50, he does some weird shit sometimes, but you can see the genius behind it. Some of the shit that he does. So now you want to see the context of what I'm talking about, so you can see if there was some genius in that shit. Yeah, of course. So you can try to think. Okay. No, 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 no. no, no. This thing with me though. I'm high. Even even when Shawty did lame shit, I said that one lame. That's okay. the difference between me and another nigga. Okay. I'm gonna say when you're lame, if it's real, real. If it's lame, lame. I but I, I, right, I said yeah. that I said that whole thing to say this. It was an interview early this year by somebody at the Breakfast Club, right? They basically said somebody in their camp was doing some shit that could have could have fucked some shit up. Maybe, maybe not. Interview. I mean, who again? The artist was Twenty One Savage. Okay. I'm just gonna keep it real. The artist was Twenty One Savage. He said his homeboy out in the street fucking shit up, so he had to leave him out there. Left him out there. The nigga died last December. Is he wrong for not fucking with him, or was it his responsibility to pull him out the street? Cause this nigga really started some shit that he ran off with and blew it up. Oh, uh, so the other nigga started twenty one shit, twenty one seven popped it up. Why the nigga was in jail? I don't know. If you do, if, if you do a dumb, I ain't not speaking on that, but if you do a dumb shit, like robbing, just destroying the business, that's different. We ain't talking about that. All right, that's that's what what I, that's what and then you still cut them out. Yeah. Now, I wonder if some. Don't ask y'all about these. Yeah, that's yeah. what he did for me. Uh -huh. Let's do a wrap up for the year. The whole 2019. Do a Damn, wrap right now? Gotta be the baby. Guess who? I'm talking about, I'm talking about with Guess who? Oh, shit. No, I'm talking about Guess who came on the show. Jesus Christ. I'm talking about Guess who came on the show. Oh, okay, okay. 
people came on the show. They do a wrap up of this show. Okay. We can get to the world like I'm doing a wrap up for the whole year. I got to feel that. I like it. Yeah, I'm gonna that shit don't 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 know how to deeper and deeper. I'm gonna be real. I'm gonna be real. I think um I think especially being the person I am, I think a couple of these people that came up here, um, I definitely should have challenged them on so many positions about um how, 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 how to proceed as like as far as like who's gonna be their children. Because everybody got children in the game. If you come out and you got some type of influence, you might have one or two kids out here. Maybe a couple possibly. You know what I mean? That just kind of bite your style and take off with it. Yeah. So like, I think I should have just gone harder on a couple people. I think just being transparent with the, with the folks, I think a lot of times I didn't just because um, I felt like a certain type of allegiance to like, I appreciate when people come and support the show, period. You know what I mean? And I'm not saying we trying to build numbers, so I'm not, I'm not here to make enemies in the same way I'm trying to, I'm trying to keep it real too. And I think I missed a couple times to just keep it all the way real with y'all, just to keep it yeah. factual. You know what I mean? I think I should have pushed on a couple of these niggas, like, because there's some weird shit going on. Especially when a couple of these gangster niggas that I know got real gangster resumes and they come on here and they support. A nigga like Young Thug, just because he bust a gun and he, he wore a skirt too. Like, don't talk about him busting a gun, let's talk about him wearing a skirt. Do you agree with that? I should push that. Okay. And for any of you other niggas that do know that nigga, if you come on the show, I'm gonna push that. So just be prepared. It's so true. You don't have any question about that funny shit, cuz. They just talked about that later. Cause everybody say they know him. So that's what I'm saying. Yeah. I can't yeah. write into that shit. Who y'all think so far been like like the, the easiest to, to do guests? Like interview episode. Like who y'all think was like what the favorite? Just flow the best. I say dog uh, on, man. I was like dog on, bro. I would yeah. say Moody. Nah, I would say Moody had a man. I say Moody, uh, Nikki Novelty. And Dirty Red. Dirty Red had to do it too. Yeah, it's my favorite game. Dirty Red. Yeah. I got it. Yeah. She had a good time with Nick. Nah, nah, nah you, you was tripping. <laughs> <laughs> you, you was fucking, man. Oh, God. Oh, God. You was fucking. No, 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 no. I don't that song yeah, the yeah, day. I went out of the show. I had it too, so I'm trying to see. You know what I'm like? Y'all just got to watch the show I went through. I was looking at one show. I'm going to say the real shit. I think one of our guests is a female. Who? I know. Just based on me doing. <laughs> and I'm mad that you I said know one though. Hold on. I'm pissed off that you said one. I'm keeping it cheap. I know you talking about. Why not? Yeah, I know you talking about. We ain't gotta say the name. We'll yeah. talk about our. Both of them. Can I ask you this? What? You know where we failed at? That we only pissed off one guest for the year? It's 23 episodes. Only one motherfucker got pissed off? Oh, what's all that little whispering? Yeah. Now nah, I'm telling you something. Who the person was? What? What? We ain't gotta say the name. Nah, I'm gonna tell y'all. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Yeah. I look at it like this, fellas. <laughs> we ain't no motherfucking like. <laughs> yeah. Not like, 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 like. I ain't, I ain't. You know what I mean? I respect niggas. Exactly. I ain't. This Atlanta, bro. You feel me? Huh? On, we ain't, I ain't on my fault, on my end. Yeah. However, nigga want to present himself, however, you know what I mean? Any the artist, let me say this, I ain't talking to y'all, I'm just saying. Like, I just be want to know, you know what I mean? Whatever we talking about, we ain't here to interview y'all niggas, we not exactly. no motherfucking glad. Is that what I tell you? Exactly. We not, not, it's not an interview show, this is a kid like, shit and get shit up out your show. Like, really. cause I know, like, it's a long shit can be, you can be smiling and then, Gunfight. Yep. Exactly. So I be, I wish, I get cause I'm, you know what I mean, with nigga out here daily, like niggas, yeah. niggas right there. I feel you one day, cuz. I look at them all like shit. Come I, on, kick shit. We gonna laugh, we gonna drink, we gonna smoke. Well, Whatever we shit. talking about, we talking about. We talking about. I'm gonna be honest. Shit, you know, I'm gonna be honest. Since I'm definitely not gonna go interview. Since it's a rapper. Since it's a rapper. I'm making it personal. I don't, I don't interview rappers. I, I fuck with certain you. niggas and they pull up and we kick shit. All right, check. I'm gonna be honest with y'all. Everybody else, I appreciate everybody that came on this show. I appreciate yeah. you two brothers for, for having yeah. me on this show. But I'm going to tell you the real guy, the honest truth. I know two of y'all niggas. 
And that doesn't mean anything. I'm not nobody to know y'all niggas. Don't get confused. I'm just saying. I don't. I have no idea who these motherfuckers be. You be having 145,000 followers. All I want to know. All I be wanting to really get to is like how real a motherfucker is. Like, can you stand on top of like? Is it worth? It? I only want to check out your music. I don't care what you're talking about. I only want to check it out if that's what you're really with in a real life. Now, I mean, then I know I can call you a real motherfucker. Real doesn't mean that you shoot guns. Real doesn't mean that you do this. Real, real means that you do exactly what it is that you're talking about. Yeah. Period. And I can appreciate that. But a lot of these niggas, I had no idea who they was. And I appreciate the crew in the back. Uh, shout out to nigga Q. That be researching these guys up and um, yeah. coming up with these questions because I don't be knowing who y'all niggas is. But I appreciate y'all coming on and y'all bringing y'all fan base to the show and everything. <laughs> <laughs> we'll keep it funky. Uh, you know I, mean? I listen to XM Radio. Man, you know how many pa uh, podcasts popped up since we dropped our shit? I swear to God, we really pioneered this shit, man. Everybody. Nobody wasn't doing this shit last year. Nobody. Nobody. It's Nobody. 800 podcasts pop up every week. Is that? It's like church, nigga. We all would be seven, the 700 that close down every week. I don't even think folks were really saying facts like that last year. Nah. To be honest. But we did. We yeah, saying I, it again. I look at it. Hey, man. I don't know, bro. I've been in my own world and shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I look at all. It was all the artists. I guess because 99% of them nigga already knew. Exactly. They were showing love, and just cause this, this shit might go to another point, I still look at it from the, the day one. You know exactly. what I'm saying? Exactly. The trend, the trend, the trend. Baby day. Baby day. That was yeah. still yeah. see. Yeah. 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 I'm talking about like, bro, we, we building. Yeah. We yeah. Going, you know we what I'm saying? We not in. We right. right. I don't give a fuck Here. about you. You gangsta, none of that. None of that. I, I ain't, I don't know you. No, I'm like, nigga, gotta really stay together, bro, because there's so much more we do. You see what I'm saying? And we was just having a conversation while we were 30 minutes late, nigga. I was just harassing us on the text. We was just having a conversation. As long as we stay focused. Yeah. Now, yeah, as, man, as long as we fucking stay focused, nigga, like, everything's gonna work out. The best thing to do in this world is to come up on it. Everybody else will follow suit. And that goes for everybody that's watching. Like, yo, you got a couple of haters and shit that, that, that bring you down, though. Like, people that love you. Because sometimes, you know, you don't care about the haters that be on social media and the niggas that you don't really know. Like, that that can inspire you. But sometimes the niggas that love you and they hate, sometimes that shit brings you down. And I'm going to tell you, mm -hmm. like, yo, just let that shit be motivation, bro. Like, don't let nobody stop the fucking marathon. If you got to jump on the train, if you got to kick a nigga five, ten dollars to come pick you up to go do exactly. what the fuck you need to do, make sure you I'm going to keep it G, right? Yesterday, some shit happened. I ain't want to come do this shit today. You know what I mean? Because of what happened. But I had to get myself locked in. You know what? Said got some shit going. Stay focused. I want to do this shit. Yeah, yeah, go for this shit. Nigga ain't paying. You know what I mean? So I know nigga had days when they don't feel like coming to do it. Yeah. That's why a nigga like me, when I get to that level with this shit, I'm not going to say I can't. Kind of know, part of shut. Everybody in their room had days they didn't want to come. Oh my God. You the see day, what I'm saying? Today was my day. Today. But day was niggas day. came. So I gotta fuck. It's Today was my day. I straight up called that man. My girl, my girl bluffed me at four o'clock. I'm supposed to be here at four o'clock. We get to the parking lot. We get to the fucking parking lot. She got mad because I handed her some trash to throw away. That fucking right I'm talking about. She got mad because I handed her some trash to throw away. She and then started talking to me about a fucking ride. <laughs> like I ain't like I ain't like I ain't King Abu Dhabi. Like I just gonna hop on my magic carpet and get the fuck on somewhere. Listen, baby, what I'm telling you is personal. <laughs> you keeping this shit too, though. No. Yeah. But, 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 but I'm telling you is personal. This is what I'm telling you. I love you sincerely. I only want to deal with your shit, but what I'm telling you is your shit will never stop my shit. Period. I only want to deal with your shit, but your shit will never stop my shit. And they said they're keeping this shit, so I'm gonna have to deal with this shit. You got to listen. I ain't got to listen. Listen, listen. God, 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 listen.
<laughs> he said he got to count. Wait. Don't let it be a problem. Oh, damn. Oh, God. God. I got 150 songs in my notebook. Don't make me get lost in the studio for a week while we fighting and, yeah. and turn into Drake. That's all I'm saying. Yeah. I will get up. I'm light skinned. I'm emotional. I will go in there and sing about you. And make a bang. I'm telling you. But nigga. What? I have all the quick. I have all y'all in here like this to that shit. Like, <laughs> slow jams and shit. They go like that ass. Nah, but yo, that burger was good earlier. <laughs> Trying to clean it up real quick. Nah, that burger. I'm just telling you. 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 Yeah, nah, I don't bro. know. I, I just seen he all doing documentaries on black niggas. Only right. Niggas I fucked up. Only doing documentaries on black niggas. 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 Only doing documentaries on my name's Russell too. It is known for red niggas named Russell to be perverts. I'm not. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'm not saying that that means a pervert. I'm not saying that. No. Listen. Fuck that, guys. This nigga's red. Look, light skinned niggas got a problem, guys. You can't give a light skinned nigga money. I'm gonna tell you why. This nigga gets his hair cut every week and he thinks he's fucking Harry Belafonte. If he be around here, then he can touch every cat. Turn your finger, monkey. I'm not saying that's what that man was doing. No, I'm not tripping, cuz. I'm telling you the facts, nigga. Do you think there's a girl? Hold on. Let me ask you something. So, what you saying? Hold on, hold on. Let me ask you something. Let me ask this question. Let me ask this question. No, we went for hip hop. No, no, let me, no, we're still going hip hop. Let me ask you a question real quick, cuz. They crucified. No, I'm not. Do you think there's any? Dog, listen. Do you think there's any nigga? Do you think there's any? Do you think there's any woman that Drake think he can have? As a light skin, he can have everything. I did. As a light skin nigga, as a light skin nigga that's the godfather of hip hop. Now I mean. You don't think you can touch any little sweet butt walking around the motherfucking office? Yeah. I'm not saying he did this shit now. Yeah. I'm just saying, if I had a billion dollars and you was an intern at my fucking office, what you would do? If you were looking, <laughs> tell me that. You were looking nice well, and right. What's going to be that do? So you I'm, I'm going to be like, hey, can I tell you? I'm, 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 I'm grabbing pussy. No, I'm not I'm grabbing pussy. What's going to be? Yeah, it's real. Hold on. I'm not grabbing pussy. I'm not grabbing pussy. I'm not grabbing pussy. I'm not grabbing pussy. I'm being real, nigga. Listen, niggas. If that girl, hold on. That God damn it. If that girl, if that woman is grown. Hold on, nigga. If that woman is grown, right? And I know she's single, and I got a billion dollars, nigga. And I'm sitting up there all high and mighty. I'm offering that woman coffee. I'm offering that woman lunch. Yeah. I'm offering that woman whatever I think that woman wants. If I'm, in a, if I'm, if I'm interested in that Why woman. Huh? Wait, Why Why the remix? Why the remix? What's the remix? <laughs> this is the original version. I thought you put sex on crazy. The remix. No, I thought you didn't say that. No, cuz that's why I got a daughter. What I'm saying is, that's good. Let's get back to Oprah. Let's get back to Oprah, though. Let's oh, no, now Oprah's some bullshit. Because listen, Oprah then sat up here with that man in a billion dollar boys club. Sat up there, you know, they done been to all the parties together, eating all dirt, toasting, and all that good high and mighty shit. You done had this nigga on your couch in a fucking yoga position, talking, chilling. Right? Y'all supposed to be the best of friends. Your homie, Harvey Weinstein, is fucking, like, fucking bitches for movie roles that they not even get. You so, know what, hold on, man, you know what crazy though, no, bro? I hate to say it, bro. What? Niggas been doing it. Everybody been doing that shit, bro. When you, when you in the, when you in business, bro, and you young, I can't, I'm talking about from when one nigga in business young. What shit, bro? We, yo. This is yeah, yeah, bro, put your own. That's she, it, that's it. She and I took this shit to a whole nother level. But she, what we gotta realize though right now, this is the last days, my nigga. This is prophecy. They said 
institutions would fall that you thought would never fall. Look what happened to the bull at Penn State. Fucking Joe Paterno. He ain't had nothing to do with touching them kids. Them motherfuckers were probably about to name the stadium after this nigga. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? That shit's over. Yeah. Russell Simmons made a billion dollars off a of rap. Nigga. You understand what I'm saying? Man, off a of rap, cuz. And, 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 and that nigga just fell. He had to, nigga, this nigga had to offset his whole company. Like, yo, I'm not, I don't own it no more. Yeah. You can't sue the company. Yeah, you know I mean, he had to do all that type shit just to deal with this shit. I don't and nigga be losing like that. And it's like, no, cause they know what to do strategically. Yeah. But the thing is, my nigga, I'm asking you that. That's trying to question it. Do we think re regular shit really is fucked up? You mean regular? Because in his mind, he saying no because he said I'm not a savage. I'm not taking it from a girl. I'm not on malicious shit. He not thinking. Oh, really, when you that? slap a girl on the ass, that really against the rule. Mm -hmm. yeah, you, 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 you know what I mean? Uh, so he said, I'm not saying this is the case or nothing, but I'm just saying, like from the average nigga would think that. That's how they think. They think fuck up. Shit. If I'm playing with you, I ain't fuck up. Yeah. But if but I'm like, I'm some uh, shit. You know what I mean? See, though, know, I think it really. I thought they need real females in there, bro. I, 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 I think the type of. Like, they did the. the the shit that going on with Bill Cosby and all that shit, when you in the hood, you hear a different response for the black woman from the hood versus the ones you seeing on the media, the one they showing in interviews. Yeah. Bill Cosby some bullshit. In, black girls in the hood would have took that situation a whole nother way. So, but they're not putting a lot of light on the black girls in the hood. They're saying, hey man, look, we don't call the police on our nigga all the time. You yeah. right. Because we are in. You right. Feel me? Yeah, we don't got the fight. But Bill Cosby. They ain't making that a me. They ain't, they ain't, they ain't putting. I'm looking at what they showing, bro. Mm -hmm. Like they showing these type of women talking about black men. They ain't showing the real ones that down yeah. talking about black men. Black you man. feel me? Yeah. Like, they definitely not gonna show that. They ain't gonna show that. Oh, they never got the fun with no. shit. This nigga died for that one time with the wolf. You know what? Huh? You, you know, feel me? You know what would prove Bill Cosby's innocence to me? Talk to Felicia Rashad. That was a bad motherfucker. Yeah. And if that nigga ain't never tried that motherfucker. I don't believe he tried that Howard Stern looking bitch. Like that's crazy. Yeah. They, that man that bitch look like Howard Stern. Kyle. I think Bill Cosby was a hit, man. They they, they try to destroy that man whole. Yeah. Image. They yeah. erase him from. Like yeah. think about any other show that there was a black doctor and a black lawyer. They yeah. try to erase. And that. Not, not only that. Shit, yeah. Not only that. The college shit. The fucking yeah. different world. Yeah. yeah. Niggas going to college. Exactly. Yeah, wait. This nigga show still come on every week. Yeah, I was like, I was looking at what, I mean, yeah. I went trying to You can't stop the hit. Well, that shit still come on. Pac said that shit, you can't stop the hit, nigga. I, I, I said it say far as the, 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 the females, you know what I'm saying? I think we got to start putting more emphasis on the solid ones. Ain't, ain't enough camera yeah. on them, bro. Exactly. They showing the sellout. They, look at Oprah, bro. She, she's selling out. Yeah, 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 yeah. We got yeah. light on them. I got to about we got to stay on the Oprah shit. I got to disagree with that. She's selling out. The Oprah shit, like. I got to disagree with the shining. I don't see her doing a few things about she was, she she was talking about public schools back in the day. I think. I, that shit really, that problem, I was like. I think, I think, you know what it is, dog? Yeah, black you see, what it is, dog, we, we, we took the ways of the savage. Now, I mean, the savage believed the man was over the woman. As a black man, we never believed that. We believed woman was God. Mm -hmm. From our culture, we believed woman was God. So, when you come into a patriotic, patriotic society where you're thinking that man is the supreme one, like, you get into these theories that, like, um, I mean, Oprah should have did this or Oprah should have did that. Like, nah, nigga. Like, Oprah's doing what the fuck Oprah's supposed to do. Like, what you mean by that? What like, why are y'all confused? So because she black, she shouldn't have to. She, she, and that woman selling out. No, man. Oprah's not selling out. Oprah, Oprah, fucking nigga. If you think Oprah's selling out now, you miss what she did twenty years ago. What she when, did. when Oprah got into position to be able to become a billion, you gotta what before you know. Before hold on, before you become the billionaire, you gotta do something to show that you'll sell out. So we missed the sellout. This wasn't the sellout. Her talking about Russell Simmons wasn't the seller. She sold out a long time ago. Yeah, of course. Yeah, so what, 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 what I just said about her talking about public school, I was in high school when she said it. Mm -hmm. That's when I been to well, she, she ain't fucking with her. Basically, long story short, she already going to a private school that's yeah. already rich and better get her some money. But that makes that makes sense when you got money. But that don't but make sense. You don't got money. In the hood. No, it don't. But she don't give a fuck. 
fuck about the children that's in the hood. That's not what she said or not. That's what she talking about. But she don't give a fuck about the children in the hood. You yeah. saying? Why, 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 why should she? Nigga, cause that's nah, the keep it from me though. If it's my front, if I'm in the hold up, man. Hold on. This is the problem. You, you, you gotta no. let me say this. Yo, hey. You just said this lady, don't uh-huh. give a fuck <laughs> about yep. the bottom. And then yep. turn around and ask me how she said it. Know why? No, I she wasn't no, I see what he's no, saying. No, she no. wasn't never with it in the first place. God damn. You gotta be Holy with it. Shit. You gotta be with it to sell out. Holy she shit. wasn't never fucking so with it. Why do you want motherfuckers that didn't start with you to feed you, nigga? That's nutty shit. They can never understand how your stomach aches, nigga. This. They can never understand. As a black person, they will never show like, compassion you know, to you that. You in guy. a certain position, you not finna a black, black person. Bro, well you in the sun. No, well, we see no. it differently then. You no, know, no, we see it I'm the same. I'm talking about where I came from bro. and how can I bro. help it. Bro, I'm not bro. giving a motherfucker. No, I ain't giving. I ain't. Uh, once I got that crowd already, I'm my job Cause, done. Cause we see I ain't it. going to Africa. I got this, bank here. Cause we see it the same. The difference is what you're not understanding is they see it different. Yeah, you nigga, see. you can't. Like you that. can't be. You can't yeah, be. Understand. You can't be saying, where she's at. Fucked up. You can't be where she's at to serve us. Yes, that's the no. That's the sacrifice you have to make. So you say she can't use her platform to. To help mm-hmm. black folks? Fuck no! I, your platform gets destroyed! Man, if Tyler Perry did, man, no, he I did. See, I see what he no, said. He no, he did! No, he did! did it, Tyler Perry did not do shit! Man, that man Dude. created so many jobs for Cut. him, man! Alright, alright, check. Alright, he did that, right? You know I mean? But guess what he did? For man. 20 years, he showed little black kids that it was okay to wear a fucking dress! But you can't take How many motherfuckers that he brainwashed to think Thank that you. How many motherfuckers did he brainwash to think that it was okay to wear a fucking dress and get a billion dollars? So basically what you're saying is, he sold out first, then they gave him the opportunity to be who he is there. No, 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 no,
make up planet and look at when you see that on a drink. I'm about to kill you right now. I'm about it to kill used to you be right now. Mar had it on nigga. too, bro. When you go in the kitchen, I nobody said it. Martin had on the dress too. Alright, yeah. nigga. No, Martin ain't got a billion dollars. He ain't putting a bunch he, of motherfuckers on. He made a No, no, check. Put now check. On. But this is what I'm asking you, she And he did it better than Martin. Nigga, if you go, nigga, if you, you, nigga, if you go in the fucking kitchen and spill some milk, you gonna leave it there? Nah. You gonna clean the fuck up, right? Yeah, yeah. All right, then. So if this nigga put these motherfuckers through peril, you getting some other motherfuckers some jobs doesn't erase this shit. Fix that shit, nigga. Clean up the spilled milk. Listen, man. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. But then I'm saying it. I'm saying it. I'm saying it. I'm saying it. responsible for. But look, the like kids. You feel me? You, yo, bro, y'all kids see this same nigga. It's on the, the people. However, they gon' end up too. Some niggas just end up the way. However, they go. He ain't the first nigga to do this shit. He, he ain't gonna be the last. He the most influential. But while he's focusing yeah. on that part, he's the most, all the other Cause he the most influential. You know what? He the most influential. He the most influential. He the most influential. He the most influential. He the most you know the crazy thing is? Nah, you know the you know the crazy thing is? Both of y'all are right. But I gotta say this though. It it was a point where I told my son, don't watch this shit no more. Mm. I ain't gonna lie. Right. So yeah, what yeah, outweigh what? Which outweigh the other one? Or is it a like which like, one outweigh? I ain't gonna lie. I told my even though I hey, I understand both of y'all, I did have to tell my son, don't now, watch it no more. Now yeah. now going to she church. I don't want my son to be watching now, going to, the now going to she church. Mm -hmm. on, the, it's on, the, on the principles of mock. You know what I mean? On the principles no. of mock, when you weigh the heart against the feather, your good deeds outweigh your bad deeds. I'm saying, I'm saying as a nation, I see you know, to see Turk, man. I mean, I knew, I knew that before, I, I just had to plug you, guys. <laughs> I knew that before, I had to plug you, though. Yeah, I had to plug you, though. But listen, <laughs> what, I'm, what I'm saying is this, though, fam. Like, at the end of the day, it's like, what you have in that information, you still got to clean up what you did wrong. Just because you're doing something right for them. I don't think he think he might think that's cleaning it up, though. I don't think he think he did something wrong. I don't think he think that, bro. Yeah, I, don't, yeah, he I don't, don't think he feel like that. Hey, dude, because when he got the pressure from the black community, that's why he retired from being. Why would you retire from something that's making you a bag every month? Man. Every time you come off a fucking play, all these black women coming out here to watch a black man act like a female because they love that shit. Man, that man got it makes it clip that shit. Like, that shit crazy. Man, if I got a kid, no, bro, I ain't got to do that shit. I really want to ask black women a question. Y'all can go when y'all like and subscribe. Y'all can comment. comment. I want to ask y'all something. Why is it such that black women love to see a black man in drag? Like that? no, they do. They watch this RuPaul shit when they see that. Like, like they appreciate, it. like they think that like they're being so great. Yeah, they're very afraid of I'm telling you, like they think well, that. That's not true for all. Isn't that top three? But but you do know women that say that, right? That they think that they they being brave. That they, they don't get the zoos and women know that they get the zoos. I can what you're saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. But I only hear black women say that. I never heard a white woman say that. What? Oh, I, I appreciate oh, how white you know, you know now, if you say that now, I don't give a fuck. You start talking about the other race, then they're going to make it a racial thing. All right, well, put it on this. The, 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 don't even go to the other race. Let's keep it with the black women. How you nah, feel about that? No, 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 no. When you go to the other race, no, your, your, your point will get lost. No, it's not. Listen, listen, yeah. listen to me. It's pertinent. Though. Listen, what you really saying, once you make it racial, they gonna start talking about the racial aspect. They gonna lose your point. So don't even go to the other no, race. What you gotta understand is about the point that I'm trying. No, to I'm make. saying what you're saying. No, what it's gonna work. But to the masses, the women look to women. Do what I realize too. To the women, they emotions gonna get intact. Listen, that's good. So they're not gonna listen to us. What you're asking? No, why? They gonna go by what they no, hear. No, why? Because when women also being that they're emotional creatures, they don't apologize until they're emotional first. So if you don't do nothing to invoke that fucking emotion so they can get it out the way, we're never going to get to the fucking meat and potatoes of the situation. That's so true. fuck it. Let them hold their pussy and deal with it. Who you sent there, bitch? Listen, I'm coming straight at you. Put your 3D glasses on. This is what it is. Now I mean? White women. See, I lost my whole fucking point. Okay. <laughs> I lost my whole fucking point about the white women. I got I lost the whole fucking point. What was I talking about with the white woman? Uh, I don't know. 
know where you're going. God damn, fuck them yeah, bitches. They don't enjoy trying to brag as much as black Oh, oh they, yeah. never, they never sit in there with a community of other white women talking about, oh, did you see Billy, how he put his makeup on? It was so empowering to me as a woman. Mm -hmm. We don't get to act like that as a woman. He was such a better woman than I was. That's how black women act when they see a flamboyant ass gay guy. Oh, did you see his makeup, girl? Oh, did you? It be fucking crazy. I'm like, yo, why are you supporting this shit? Why are you looking at it as it's something to put on high? You're a fucking nut. And then you wonder why your man don't respect you like he need to respect you. Because you like gay shit, bitch. Yeah. And they ain't got nothing to do with nation building. They ain't got nothing to do with keeping my kids well-rounded and good and groomed. They ain't got nothing to do with that shit. How you they, feel? I, 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 I feel like... Oh, the flamboyant gay man. I feel like black women like make these like they infatuated with our women. This, this is my point of view. I think the women infatuated with them. Listen, man. Who acting like who? My yeah, woman is fake. born a woman. She just being herself. But they this, this the problem. Like, like we, a woman is being a woman. Well, us men can't determine what a woman is. Yeah. She is who she is. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. The men that's trying to, that we call flamboyant gay, act like women. If women went here, how would they act? But see, this is if the women went here, how, how, they see, would have nobody but, to copy. See, this is the thing you see she, what I'm saying? This is the thing she, this is the pure. But let, let me finish. They won't have, no, have nobody to copy. Mm -hmm. Feel what I'm saying? So when a woman see a man put on makeup, well, I think she ain't being no hater. She, she, it ain't looking to her like she ain't looking at it like a, a man, a straight man would. She's looking at good makeup. She looking at good makeup. But, you see what I'm saying? She, this is what I'm but the man in us, see them trying to be like with our women. Like, that's what that's see, that's bar. Let me ask y'all this. Let me ask y'all this. Let me ask y'all this though. But do we still have to be the man in us though? Because let's say like okay. This is how I know it works. When a woman looking, like you said, she looking like straight makeup, she gonna start, she gonna do everything like that. Mm -hmm. It's not gonna stop that. Yeah. That's the problem. That's why we still have to say, hey, stop. Yeah. Because they're not going out what we go, like you said, they're not us. They're not going out what we're going out. So they going out this, we going out this. And if that continues, we extinct. Yeah. Yeah, you right. We right do. Fact. They already trying to get us up out of here. It's already If we keep going the opposite way, we extinct. I think the thing is. There's already 30 of us. <laughs> we in five states. <laughs> Y'all need to know we in less than like we ain't yeah, really, I'm gonna, we ain't really no well. I'ma tell you, I'm gonna tell you why it's already fucked up. I'm gonna tell you why. Come real on, shit. man. I'm gonna tell you why, real shit. The game trying to control you. Listen, dog. When when let's take it back to animals. Yeah. When the best animals aren't breeding with the best animals, you get a weaker strain of that animal. If you got a bunch of bitch ass niggas, a bunch of breeding with a bunch of bitch ass bitches, you're gonna get a bunch of bitch ass babies. And that's what the fuck's going on. Period. You got niggas that halfway like, oh, don't hate on those niggas for wearing purses, you a bitch nigga too. Yeah, no, you need to hold that nigga accountable for wearing a fucking purse. Cause I guarantee if your son walked in the door wearing a fucking Shit, purse, you you gonna feel some type of way. <laughs> so why you not gonna hold the little weed man that you get your fucking your little thirty-five dollar three five four accountable for wearing a fucking purse around his shit too. Like be an OG, be a homie, nigga. Man, stop that shit. Like you said, them niggas, them niggas think that shit fashion, man. You know, I, I, I man, yeah, just from a nigga out there, just from a nigga out there. You feel me? I don't know how nobody else feel. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know what niggas be when we leave. Yeah. I don't know where you be. I don't know where you be. I just know where I be. You feel me? And I be looking at it like. I remember we first started wearing v necks My big yeah. brother was born in, he 40 something. He like, y'all nigga wearing girl shirt now? Like, what you yeah, talking yeah. about? Them v neck And v necks girls used to wear that shit. But you right, know, the yeah. shit changed. But, you, but exactly. do, that, do that make yes. the same gangster yes. niggas that was in the tank top, yes. the same thugs that was yes. in the tank top seat. You know Hold on, it, brother. It makes it different. Hold on. I understand. Yeah, them same gangster niggas that started the gang member shit they had on the, the, on, the tank man. top seat through and they murdered yeah. too. You can't judge a nigga for that when it come when it come to that. You These niggas money. ain't playing out here. I'm money. out here. Yeah. Yeah. Ain't nobody playing that's the same money. nigga with the purse on. That's got a, the that's that, a that shit in me. And nigga talking about what a 
don't leave a guy on. No. That's a mute point. You know why? Because the principal no, is say, yeah, it is. Just because you don't got, just because you got a fucking gun doesn't make you a gangster. Man, you should know that. But it's a lot of niggas shooting. You should know that. It's a lot of niggas shooting. Just because you shooting doesn't make you a gangster. You should know that. Make you gangster enough. No, it don't. No, it don't. Because I'm saying, nigga. Hey, look. Let me say, let me say, let me say. Trust me. You got to say that. Let me 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 say that. I, I, once again, I agree with both of y'all, but she mm -hmm. please don't say and make it gangster enough. Because then what we gonna lead niggas to believe. I it's suck a nigga don't know what I'm fit. It's suck a nigga who go ride with the crew. Mm -hmm. I been in that position. So I don't, I don't like what niggas say. I'm gonna keep it G. Because I'm been in the car and that suck a nigga who believe it. What you just said, mm -hmm. told on everybody. That's mm -hmm. what I'm saying. So when we promote that, we gotta be careful. That's what I'm saying. Because Mr. that nigga there. You thought you thought you thought us. I, do, I thought the best thing to do is to talk about it. Yeah, we we yeah, keep talk about it, not promote it. I not ain't promoting. I'm just saying. I'm from cause I'm hot though. I don't like I said. I don't know. I don't know, but niggas know I'm hot. Man, look, I'm cross street. You feel what I'm saying? Everybody got fire. Mm -hmm. Not saying they are gangster cause they got the fire, but everybody got it. Yeah. Nigga, the lame, ain't no such thing as a lame nigga, nigga, ain't no shoot, nigga. I don't see nigga shoot, I never thought of shoot. Right, facts. Nigga don't even look like they got it in them. Facts. No, why? So, er, hey, man, hey. Them be the first one guys. to shoot. Nigga, the guys, you guys don't guys, cause yeah. a lot of times, cause a lot of times. I ain't trying to wait and see who got guns. Niggas be claiming they know the streets, but niggas be saying shit like, oh, well, a scary nigga to shoot too. A scary nigga's gonna shoot first. Yeah. Man, everybody they gonna shoot, they gonna be the first one to put it. Jeez, ain't no scale on to, to be scared of niggas shoot, the gangster niggas shoot, the nerd shoot. Man, this is America, man. Yeah. Niggas is fired up, bro. Dog, I'm the telling scale, you, the man. Scale, the scale is this. That's how cool it is. They don't got to shoot. That's the nigga with the power. That's the nigga with the juice. If I'm in the same hood that you're in, and I do the same shit you do, mm -hmm. but I ain't get shot at, niggas ain't snaking me. Yeah. Niggas ain't robbing me. Who's real? All right then, so that's what the fuck I'm talking about. Half these niggas running around with the little joint in their purse is the same niggas holding the joint because they got robbed. And they man ain't do nothing. Now they got the banger on them because they people ain't do shit. We wasn't getting robbed because when a nigga came in the door looking shifty, your boy already ran on him. Now you ran and look crazy. Now the next thing you, you know, you're super dancing on these niggas. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? I so we can't promote that. These niggas that just cause you got this wardrobe that you against it. No. Now what we can do is this. I can doubt your benefits before I give you the benefit of the doubt. So being that you got a purse on, being that you got a gun in your purse, being that you got your sister's jeans on, if it walk like a duck, it quack like a duck, it's a duck nigga, and you a duck nigga. So you need to duck nigga. <laughs> now I mean? Before you be laying down like a Fuck nigga. <laughs> like, come on, sound like real talk. Put the balls on him real quick. Cause like, oh, it's crazy. That nigga never dropped the ball. Quick, quick, little foe. Yeah, quick, little foe. Little foe. Yeah. I'm crazy, nigga. You got your point of view. Where we at? Nah, niggas are different. Let's look at it. This is a much better show without you. I'm gonna be real with you. I like this show better than when y'all be on here. <laughs> now I'm gonna say now you told me yeah, you said you was right. Oh yes, no, no 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 no! You <laughs> should send me that fucking text, guys. Brothers, no. I ain't get cocky. No, you that's not cocky. cocky. That's how I feel. That's not cocky. cocky. I just said no. Y'all I just said. I just said. Hold on. I just said. This is not me though. You speaking for us? Yeah. When you say this stuff, we gotta we no, gotta yeah, it gotta be a hold on, hold on, no, 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 no. What? Because when you said your bullshit, what did I do? Bullshit is whatever, whatever shit. 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 What that man saying? Yeah. That's all you gotta do. Yeah, 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 yeah. Letting this whole his 
shit. Yeah. I'm good with these. You know what I mean? Anybody want to come with this? I'm talking about what Ness said. I'm good with it. Well, see, I'll, I'll, I'll be talking I'll argue with, with you. I'll debate with yeah. you on Twitter. You talking about like with the company like, itself. Like, like, nigga, see, I got the how you, the how you looking at it. You got, you entitled to it. Okay. All right? But I, I still be wanting to come to an agreement. So we, because I might feel a certain way. It might impact y'all. In a negative way, that, right. that, that when we walk away from each other. So then, let me ask yeah. you. This. You see what I'm saying? Say, do you think I said? Do you think I said anything that would take money off the table? Nah, be yourself. I ain't saying. No, no, no. You say something about it. I think you cut me off before you get in the point. You cut me no, off. No, 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 yeah. no. Like you gotta hear what I'm saying. Yeah. We all got our own shit going on. This ain't all I do. This ain't all he do. This ain't all you do. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So. Anything I say when it pertaining to this, still if I say she said it, they somebody come, we here too. Alright, so let me do this. Nah, you do Hold on, hold on, let me do this. You gotta fin let me finish no, what I'm saying. Let me finish what I'm saying. Yeah, you can tell them so you can get understanding. Like, I feel how you feel, but now we're around each other, it's like you gotta move in some way. Cause you speaking you. from a and R way or I got you. from front of people that you around. I got you. From the people that I'm around might be completely different. And I you feel me? I'm not saying this is what's going on, I'm just saying for the future, because uh, I might say something that nigga run up on you about. So let me out. You did what I'm saying. So let me, so let me do this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can see this. Hey. I love my family up here with Facts Facts Facts, facts Podcast. Anything I say causes you to say anything to them, direct that shit to me. <laughs> I'm not changing nothing I They can say what they want to say though. I don't Let me say this yeah, though. I'm running home. I'm running home. Be no nigga. No, what we talking about here? I ain't got to say that though. Like, I know I ain't got to say it. I'm just, I'm glad yeah. you feel what you feel. Now I know you yeah. feel like you feel. Yeah. I can, all right, that shit broke then. I'm, yeah. not, I'm just saying. Listen. <laughs> I, I don't, I don't, I don't give a fuck. I live on 13th Street, I'm not gonna tell you the address. That's nutty shit. Yeah. But you can see me walking my sugar riders and shit if you want to catch me. You know what I mean? So if I say something that offends you, stand on how you feel. I'm perfectly right. fine. You can look up that symbol. We don't give a fuck. Nah, right. <laughs> Come down there and get your issue. But we do appreciate all y'all. Yo, I appreciate every one of y'all niggas that I knew and did not know that came on the show and, and helped us boost our numbers. I'm just saying, from my personal opinion, yeah. this feels better to me. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Yeah. I get confused. <laughs> if you want to rap about it, I'm with that too, because that makes for good business. So. When Gens be here, it feel like a interview versus a, and we interview at least. Yo, let's talk about battle rap. What's going on? Not not battle rap like the industry, but like. How how one of y'all to go out a nigga? Like if somebody came at y'all, right? And it was <laughs> not not even on the record. Let's just say like being that we industry folks, right? And like we, we totally removed from the streets and shit. If somebody came at you and you knew that, you know, doing it after what it did would jeopardize bigger shit. Being that you got an outlet with the podcast and you do you direct it there? Is that your new gun now? Like instead of talking shit on him? Yeah, do you just talk shit Person on him on songs? records instead of just nah on records too, instead of just going out and smacking them. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Me personally, it it, it I'm gonna bring it how you call it. If we in the street and you do some shit, I'm not rapping about it. If you make a song, I'm gonna make a song. Now, I wonder if it's something. If you like, raise dogs, I'm gonna bring my dog. But wonder if it's something like a nigga just did some bitch shit. He ain't say nothing on no song, but he did some bitch shit. But it's like you got shit going on. You can't catch a lawsuit from going over there and ball the nigga the fuck up. You see what I'm saying? It's not like so, hey, hold on, what happened? I can't talk about that. <laughs> I can't talk about that. It wouldn't sound like happen. Nah, because listen, possession is not a tense of the law, and you can't say too much to incriminate yourself about squatting on these and shit. But okay. Whoever did something to me just know that. <laughs> so, you know what I mean? Um. <laughs> Yeah, you know. <laughs> hey man, I feel like how I feel when it comes to that shit though. I ain't doing that song shit either. I don't take that shit that serious to a nigga like me. Like, I don't even like talking about that shit. Hey, I just want to volunteer my services. You know what I 
I'm back active this year. Like beef, like rap beef, yeah. like not even. Yeah. He's so saying like if I get big again, well, when I get big again, no, no, right now, right now, yeah, right now. If a nigga take a shot at me on the song, what would I do? Not anything, just a shot in industry life. Cause it don't gotta be a point where you on another podcast and say something about oh. Fact five has I'm gonna get on here and say something back then. Okay. I ain't gonna do the song about it. Oh, I'm tearing I'm tearing niggas up. Every nah. venue I got. <laughs> nah, you getting every gun, every gun I got, nigga. <laughs> Hold on. Let's go over here, we're gonna record a song. I'm coming up on here on this fucking podcast. I'm talking my shit. I'm throwing up game I, mean, I, I ain't mad at you, cause if niggas slap me, you can't tell me what to do. Listen. I, love you, man. Like, I just say that just because I, I, I made a comment earlier that some people may take offense to. She brought notice to me that, you know, I don't speak for the whole people at this table and I understand that. And I just want to say anybody that may have been offended that's a rapper, I also am a rapper. And, you know, we can make money for each other. If you want to make a publicity something about it and, you know what I mean, you want to say, <laughs> want to say something about this life song, and I can, and I can come it, back and I can yeah. rebuttal. Nah, we're talking about hip hop. And I can rebuttal and I can slay you and you think you can take on Ness? I'm with it. It, it may be the stacker. <laughs> you know what I mean? I doubt it though. I think yeah, I can really just, you know, ball a lot of people. I can't see up. me doing that, bro. I can't see you making a song about it. What make nigga pull a Nick Cannon and make two, three songs about you? I still be like, man, this nigga. Hey, shit. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, shit. but this nigga trip. Man, this nigga tripping. Yo. But if something happened, don't, it's, don't you I, I try to be cool, so I don't want nothing to happen to a nigga and then a nigga be living there, nigga. That's yeah. why I, I could know. Look, man, the rap out. Y'all niggas got to be like the end, man. Yeah. Talk Say something, baby. Talk to me, get us ready to go. Hit me holler and I was ready to go. Oh, fuck, and then them said some shit? I'll write some shit right now, nigga. Yeah. Nigga was like, all right, go ahead. Yeah, talk, talk to me. Yeah, yeah. You know, talk to me. Yeah. <laughs> hey, so let me talk about it. That's all I'm saying. Let me talk about it. Hey, to all everybody that want to come on those shit. Nigga be chilling, man. I don't want no nigga to feel uncomfortable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, can, we, can we get some connects on? The food stamp lady that watches the show, can you come on? Can, uh, <laughs> can the bodega man come on and make the poppy sandwiches? Can you come on so I can get them for a dollar and a quarter instead of a three fifty? Um, Let's see, can a gas station man come on? Habibi, can you come on this motherfucker over there at the ship? Now, what is that? The new street? Yeah, nigga. The BP over by Sister Road, by the yellow store, by the old yellow store. Y'all go ahead, come on. Pick and pay niggas. I fuck with y'all, even though y'all got me locked up back then when I put the uh, trash can in front of y'all door and store, y'all shit in front of y'all motherfucker. It's all good, that's old shit. Seven years removed, I can talk about it now. But that was fucked up. Cause y'all know that that was insurance. Y'all could have wrote those chips off. My man got a thousand <laughs> chips back there right now. I don't even know where they came from. I see about four or five bags every come and come and shoot the podcast. Y'all niggas got me locked up on a dollar fifty or some chips. That's some fucking shit, man. It was a it was a real hard time getting the job. Man, it was a real fucking hard time getting the job. Crazy. Cause I had some petty theft shit over some funky ass chips. <laughs> 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 Like, like, I'm gonna sit in your pants, bitch. I don't want your bitch. I was hungry, motherfucker. You like, nigga, went and took some chips. <laughs> God damn. I'm telling y'all, man. I just a big effect part of that shit. Uh, I'm not in, but I'm part of it. You know what I'm saying? These niggas coming. Yeah, yeah. I don't really, I don't, I don't get personal. This shit, yeah. Like, nigga, pull up, pull up at home. Oh, come on in, bro. I don't give a fuck shit. how nice you pull up. Yeah. It's your bitch. You ain't yeah. got an issue, so I don't give a fuck about it. Yeah, exactly. You see what I'm saying? Like, to me, it's too, it's too much going on. This ain't on my bro. I ain't looking to hurt no nigga, and I ain't letting no nigga hurt me. Exactly. Hey, let me ask y'all this. The 2020, which I want to do. What type of hat going on? Oh, that's a good question. You go first. I'm trying to talk about music. I got shit going on outside of my truck industry. You know what I'm saying? I need a couple CDL drivers. Let me say this in my commercial. I need drivers. I'm gonna pay you more than what you make, guarantee you. Whatever you make, whatever you make. I'm gonna pay you more than what you make. What you got, 62 cents? Why? What you got? Yeah, like that. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I might have to do a flat. I might do like a flat. I don't know. I might do like a flat. I don't know. I might do like a flat. I don't know. I might do like a flat. I don't know. I might do like a flat. I don't know. I might do like a flat. I don't know. I might do like a flat. I don't know. I might do like a fl
Creating, I got this, this album create too. I don't want to talk about that. But that they don't build that damn life. Yeah. I don't know, man. Put it in the middle, bro. I think about time. I'm ready. Yeah. I took a break. I don't even think I took a break. I'm just like, shit, I do what I feel like. Because yeah. it ain't that serious to me. I ain't going against no nigga. I'm going against myself. Exactly. I ain't no old ass nigga. Exactly. I got in so young, well, and it is still in the middle of the city in the break. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Like, still relevant. Like, 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 no shit, like real talk, like 2019, 2018, 2018, 2019, that was the year of preparation. 2020 was the year of promise. Everything you did, everything you worked for for 2018, 2019, if you put work in, 2020, I guarantee you, was manifestation. Man, I already seen it. I came from fucking living in the city to living 23 stories up in the middle of Midtown in a matter of a couple of weeks. It ain't had nothing to do with raise up a job or none of that. It's just manifestation. I got a whole marsupial at the crib, nigga. Now y'all niggas don't even know what branch of animal that is. <laughs> Motherfucker got a pouch, nigga. That's all you need to know. I got marsupials at the crib, nigga. I drink juice, nigga. <laughs> Fresh juice, my girl. <laughs> my girl be in the kitchen. Booty out. Yeah. Juice and shit. <laughs> <laughs> nigga. Fruits, nigga. I get fruits delivered from fucking sprouts in the whole school, nigga. Like, like nigga, nigga like dog, like we we nigga. out here, cause like next year I'm gonna get a white goat named Illuminati. I'm gonna get a llama named Alpaca Jack. Y'all gonna see me ride that bitch down the red car. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, uh, I got that shit everywhere. I got two of them. That shit turns the Listen, I got two of them. <laughs> I got two of them joints coming. I got two. Okay, of them okay, hey, listen. Yeah, this is what y'all been waiting for. I've been quiet like these last three weeks. I've been going through a lot of shit at the crib with this light skinned girl. Like, oh, y'all y'all gotta be light skinned people. What's up? No, no, nah, nah, it's not no Willie Wynn shit. I'm not, I don't subscribe to the Willie Wynn shit, but I do understand that people are people are victims of their circumstance. So when you get treated a certain way during the course of your life, it enables you to act like that as an adult. Doesn't mean that it's right. Just means that you've been taught like this and now you're enabling yourself for people around you enable you to act a certain way. And a lot of the times, the reason why I bring up a, 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 a skin color is because a lot of times, especially within our community, fair skinned people get treated a little different than darker skinned people do. Especially like down here in the South for some reason. I mean, it's just that thing like, light skinned motherfuckers was usually house niggas. Dark skinned motherfuckers was usually in the field. So it's already that perception of, oh, your life is going to be a little bit more better than mine because people look at you as a little bit nicer. You're a little bit more easier to deal with because you're a white skin. You're a nigga that's going to be like, yes. Instead of a nigga that's going to be like, fuck that nigga. I'm in the field taking cotton. Fuck you, bitch. Fuck you, here. You know what I mean? I ain't trying to get whooped. I'm saying, right, like, fuck you, bitch. You know what I mean? So it's like that whole mentality. So when I say that shit, it's not to have that holy witch mentality. It's just the it's just to look at the uh, the circumstances of what's going on. I'm a light skinned nigga. You know what I mean? I got you. You think you got special privileges over dark skin niggas? Nigga, I, 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 I can testify for being treated better than dark skin motherfuckers. Man, tell me, I, I can, I can testify, ages. dog. I done been at jobs. See, I work at different jobs too, <laughs> shit. Go tell me what you Nah, nah. I work at different jobs where it's like I gotta read schematics and blueprints and shit like that. So a lot of times they don't trust us with that type of information just because they don't want us to know too much and because they don't think that we can articulate that information that we read. You yeah. know what I mean? So I'm reading a blueprint and being that I'm from a different region and I, and I tend to stress my words a little bit different and articulate myself a little bit different. Now, I mean, I change the switch scenery. Now, I can speak Ebonics with the next nigga and I can speak like a white man. You know what I mean? So when I'm dealing with those white folks, I put them on their level so they don't feel threatened. Because I look the way I look, so I speak to them like they need to be spoken to so they don't feel threatened. 
And you feel like they picked you up. No, I'm going to tell you, this was the circumstance. This man had been there for three weeks before I had even got to that motherfucker. I ain't know shit about this job. This man asked me one time because I read this blueprint. I read the blueprint and only asked me questions about the job for the remainder of the fucking job. Even though that man had been there and said that the whole fucking job was reading the blueprint with this motherfucker for all three weeks before I even got there. But you were just smarter than that. I wasn't smarter than this nigga. This nigga had a fucking degree. The nigga was supposed to be a fucking teacher. No, man, shit. No, dog. Trust me when I tell you. The only thing. The nigga had better manners than me. And you know when I said, <laughs> no, go, run ass. And I was like, I'm making this as a man. Because I'm very much from here, cuz. Once you, <laughs> once, you do, be bro, once, you, once you do something to me to make me feel like I can't give you the same respect that I respect myself as, I'm going to start respecting you like the nigga that you showed me you was. You know what I mean? And that goes for jobs or anything because I have a skill set. You can't fire me, nigga. I'm a 1099 contractor at every job I go to. No matter if I'm making twenty dollars an hour or forty dollars an hour, I'm a contractor. You can fire me, and I'll be on another job in two hours. You know I mean? Yeah, I'm certified. So it's like I'm not job skilled. So I will tell a motherfucker, quit. Like, no, nah, I'm not doing that. Nah, you told me to do that, and I did it. And you tell me to redo it. I'm not doing that. You're not paying me enough. Yeah. Well, go home and no problem. I'll do that type of shit. So when I seen that man, very subservient and he's willing to go pick up the tools and pick up the trash and sweep. I'm like, this nigga doing everything I don't do. But you still asking me the questions about the fucking schematics. I just thank him for looking at all the like niggas. Like, I feel for back then, if they like hey. he brushed the dog, but now, that boy got a little set now to be like, man, I'll do the same. No, they no. I that, See, so I, it's some light skinned niggas. It comes, I no, it comes down that it comes down to that at the bottom line. When it comes down to the bottom line, when it comes down to saving money and who they gonna fire and shit like that, yeah, you're all good. you're all expensive. But when it comes down to who am I gonna let represent my company when I'm not here, they're gonna choose the motherfucker that they think more represents them. I don't think so. I don't think that shit come out skill. I don't know if I'm going to tell you why it doesn't come down to school. I met a seven year old black man, right? I was out here rigging crannies, right? I met a seven year old black man. He was a welder. He had been working for this company for 30 years, nigga. They hired a temp to be a foreman. They hired a nigga, they had a white boy that was 24 years old, nigga. I'm th I was 32 at the time. I had more experience than the white boy, so they couldn't say it was because he was too old to move around. Because I had, I mean, I had the same name as the white boy had. Hey, they hired a 22 year old white boy to be the foreman. And that man was 70 years old, been with the company for 30 years. They hired, they outsourced that nigga. The white folk company. They all white folks companies. Yeah, I did that. I, I did that. Construction is all white boy companies. Now, 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 talk about what you're saying. I did the same thing. It was all that white man. It's saying the same. <laughs> no, it was an old ass black man. <laughs> no, no, it was, a tw it was an old ass black man, a 22 year old white man. That's what I said. Yeah, he's saying. Yeah. I'm back. I'm back. And I own this same company. And it's an old ass white man. <laughs> <laughs> Put them on and make them learn then. Like, fuck up. That's what I'm doing. 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 That
So when this white boy doesn't perform like this nigga would have, because he knows how to delegate and knows what the fuck he's doing, now this white boy's two weeks behind. Now guess what you gotta do? You gotta pay ten thousand dollars a day for him. That wasn't worth it. You see what I'm saying? White boy don't care though. No, they they can't. Not, they they can't. can't at the end of the job when they cussing everybody the fuck out, and he. Because we don't even hire the white boy for the job. Cold man, fuck cold. He don't care when it comes to us. He don't care when it comes to him. He got a hard ass. White folks, I think they got a night of cold. Like, yeah. Bro, we, boy, hey, he's like, give him a us. Who you with? You know what I'm But saying? you know why we can't do the same thing they do? Because a lot of this, a lot of this no shit from, um, from learning it out in the field, right? Yeah. But we don't have the search for it. So when you get these jobs, you can't have a foreman just because he knows what he's doing to be a foreman. He got to have search. He got to be able to show these people the paperwork. Yeah. I mean, that be the problem with us. We go, we're so driven off a of natural talent. Like, we're so able. Like, we can see something and learn it and master it in a matter of time that it would took them years. Exactly. So, being with that, we never go get the proper paperwork to go ahead and perform those actions. Yeah, we just go all day like, fuck it, we making money. Yeah. Not knowing that you making twenty three dollars an hour for the last seventeen years, man. You supposed to be making fifty dollars an hour now. Cause them folks making a thousand. Let me ask you before we get up out of here, right? Mm -hmm. Which I want better for y'all in twenty twenty. Which I, which I think y'all are not good at now. Which I want to be better at this year. Man, I want to say that you know, stepping on the gas. Man. Say I'm gonna do something. Yeah. Acting on all these ideas I got. I don't act on all of them. I plan too much on them. You know what I'm saying? That's that, that my biggest thing, dude. Go take action during the time. Why? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Niggas don't have a business, but I know it's more shit. I know it's more things I'm capable of. Yeah. More other stuff I can be studying. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Besides being a good person. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's why the fuck I don't know all about this shit? This shit make billions of dollars. Why exactly. the fuck I don't know nothing about it? Exactly. I got a problem with it. You, 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 you do what I'm saying? Exactly. And succeed. Not just go there. Yeah. I'm trying to be in there. Shit like that. Mm -hmm. you know, I, I feel like I can know that. Should know that. It's real estate shit. Why the fuck I don't know that? It's back of my hand. It's like I got the money to do it. I'm asking questions and it ain't taking what I, I thought it took. Exactly. So like, damn, see you right here. Why? What's the question again? 2020, what do you think you saw Paul A and now that you want to be? Man, I would definitely say, uh, I mean, to piggyback off what he said, but just like, being a man, like straight from the eye and tap in the moment. Like, you know what I mean? I think I've been doing more of that, especially with like this show, making that phone call, having you shit like that. And you gave me the other phone call like niggas wanna hear sets all year if nobody else come out. And just jumping on that shit now I'm four songs deep and project. I mean like single out shit like that. I think I've been practicing it but yeah I think just more just like just, just going in on it and leveling up and just keeping home straight. I think that's another thing man just um make sure your team straight at home. I mean, and not even just financially, but just mentally and everything like that. Because it's hard to it's hard to go into the game and go do what you're supposed to do as an all star if you're thinking about what the fuck's going on after the game. I mean, I just I really feel like too everything that I've been working on the last years. I feel like I'm ready now. And I'm gonna be honest with you, a lot of shit. Nigga be like, you got all that white in there. I don't think I'm ready. That's why. It ain't worth it. It ain't nothing. It ain't nothing. It's not time. It's not what you want. Yeah. I'm ready. I think the important I'm ready thing. I'm ready now. Important With everything that I got going on, I'm ready. Life, relationship, family, business, everything. Let's go. Yeah, man. Get a home. Whatever God. Can't be destroyed. Whatever yeah. you can build, whatever you build, man can fool you. I think I'm just there with it. Like, I'm just there to do what God got. Yeah. Cause can't nobody stop that shit. Anything I, anything I plan, all these niggas can put their little monkey wrenches in it, and I'm running around trying to stack it up. Yeah. Fuck that.
Okay. I found God shaking and biting the whole with God. Exactly. The arms too short to box with God. Boy, and I said, you know what I mean? Exactly. You can do it with me all day. You can't do nothing with me. But yeah, man, y'all know how it goes. I just want to get another good shit. Yeah. Been another episode of Fat Podcast. You know how we do it. Just That's just episode we got, no guess. From this yeah. interview. Shout out to Washington. Y'all know how we come. Now for the next, nigga.